See how this precipitation has blossomed in the middle part of the country, and that is what is moving in our direction as a storm system develops and moves eastward. So let's get into the hourly details of this storm as uh, we go on into tomorrow. I'm not expecting a whole lot of weather here. Some clouds around in the morning, uh, temperatures dipping into the upper 40s. Yeah, maybe a stray sprinkle here or there uh, out of one of these clouds uh, early in the day. But overall, it looks like the biggest part of the first half of the day is dry. As we go into the afternoon, the chance of showers start to build in, especially later tomorrow afternoon on into the evening. Now I'm not expecting it to rain all night tomorrow night. We'll have some showers around uh, through the overnight. Temperatures are going to stay warmer for us and the wind won't be all that bad. That is later Thursday into Thursday night and Friday morning when that gusty wind moves in. Let's talk about your Halloween though, because as we go through the day, especially uh, through the second half of the day, the threat of rain will increase and that's into the afternoon. So here is lunchtime on Thursday. Look at these temperatures driving up in the mid to upper 60s ahead of this storm system. And then we turn into the heavier rainfall later Thursday afternoon and on into the evening. Even an embedded thunderstorm, a possibility here uh, on through Thursday evening into Thursday night. You can actually see this cold front moving through here five, six o'clock where all these winds are coming together across the area and then getting into that gusty wind as the evening goes on and it just keeps on going through Thursday evening and night. In fact, as the wind blows in, it'll bring in colder temperatures and by early Friday morning, that snow showing up on future tracker and that risk of some snow mixing with rain, a possibility into the start of your Friday morning. Now, rainfall could add up close to an inch in some spots out of the system before it gets on out of here uh, early Friday morning in the wind. Let's talk about that quickly because later Thursday afternoon, we'll start getting into those gusts of 30 to 40 miles per hour uh, through Thursday night right on into early Friday for morning, uh, dealing with some very gusty wind force. So this is a nasty storm system moving in for Thursday into Friday. 46 tonight, scattered clouds around. Tomorrow, relatively quiet until the afternoon. That's when that chance of showers builds back in. Temperatures pushing into the low to mid 60s. And then for Thursday, rain likely, especially through the afternoon and evening. Gusty wind turning colder with rain mixing to snow by Friday morning. Highs in the mid 40s, better weather moving in for the weekend. The exception, a small chance of a lake effect shower in the northern snow belt on Sunday. Otherwise, cold starts in the morning and high struggling to get out of the 50s or 40s into the 50s until next Tuesday.